Today we find ourselves at the end of the Easter season. Tomorrow we will celebrate with great joy the Feast of Pentecost and the bestowal of the Holy Spirit upon the Apostles in the beginning of the Church. Today we hear in the first reading about St. Paul in chains, physical chains in prison. But in the Gospel we hear about someone else in chains. We find Peter trapped in the chains maybe of jealousy or doubt or fear. We see him engaging in a dialogue with Jesus about the beloved disciple. He suspects that maybe the beloved disciple will be the one to betray Jesus. This part of John's gospel is so different from the rest of it because John's gospel is normally so theologically packed in talking about Jesus as the divine son of God. But this part of the gospel has more of a Lucan theme. It talks more about how Peter's conflict, about how Peter's doubts, about how Peter's fears for the Lord can impede his ministry to his brothers, to his sisters in Christ. And so he tends to lead himself to distrust of the beloved disciple. But Jesus very bluntly says to him, what concern of this is yours? It speaks to all of us that there are chains of jealousy, there are chains of doubt, there are chains of mistrust that can weigh us down. But all that the Lord asks of us is to trust in the Spirit, the Spirit that brings us true freedom, true wisdom in the presence of God, that we might be freed of all the chains that hold us back from having a full, deep, and loving relationship with God.